Hi everyone, I'm Charlene Habermeyer of Good Parenting Brighter Children, and this is Tidbits of Wisdom for Parents. Today we're going to talk about a nutrition subject. We're going to talk about eggs. Now I have to tell you, it's an interesting thing. When I was taking my 31 classes in nutrition, um, <laughs> It was very interesting because I found that nutrition is probably the most controversial subject on the planet. A lot of times people think that politics and religion is controversial, and yes, those are controversial, but let me tell you, so is nutrition. One day, something may be really good. They'll come out and say, oh, this is the greatest thing since frozen bread. Make sure you eat it. Make sure your kids eat it. And then two weeks later, they come out and they vilify it. Well, that ha is what happened with eggs. <clears throat> For a long time, eggs were known as a superfood. It was a great food because of all the vitamins, the minerals, proteins, all of those different things in it that helped us. Then they came out and said, no, they're high in cholesterol. They elevate cholesterol, don't eat them. Well, then that was uh, debunked, and now they've come out and said that once again, eggs are <laughs> in the good graces of the nutritionists out there, and they are good for us to eat. So let me point out some things because they are incredible food. I don't know that I'd call them a superfood, but pretty close to it. Number one, they're very high in protein. And the kind of protein that they're high in helps with focusing and concentration. And I want you to think about all of these different qualities about the egg because you want to have these types of foods in your children's diets because it's going to help them with their school and their success in school and beyond. So they're high in protein. They're going to help your child with focusing and concentration. They also contain a vitamin-like nutrient called choline. Choline is amazing. It helps with memory. So it's very, very important to all of us. We all want to improve our memories. We all, all want to keep our memories intact. And so choline in eggs, and by the way, what I'm talking about is eating the entire egg, the egg yolk and the egg white. If you're going to get the perfect amount of protein, the perfect amount of all these nutrients, you need to eat that yolk. I'm not sure quite why people don't eat it. It's amazing. So choline, that's important for memory. You also have the eggs are gluten-free. There's a lot of problems with gluten nowadays, and um, I'm going to be talking about that and some of the reasons of why we're having all the gluten issues. But for right now, understand and know that eggs are gluten-free. So if you have a child that has any problems with gluten, they can eat an egg without any issues and having any kind of gluten flare-ups. Eggs also contain essential amino acids. In fact, they contain <clears throat> nine of the essential amino acids. We call them essential, if you recall, because the body doesn't make them. The body has to get them from other kinds of foods. So if you eat an egg, you're getting nine of the essential amino acids that your body needs to function. <clears throat> now, it is true that eggs are high in cholesterol, but just because a food is high in cholesterol doesn't mean that it will raise cholesterol in the blood. And that's what they found with eggs, that even though they are high in cholesterol, and by the way, cholesterol is fat. So just remember, your brain is 90% fat. Your brain wants fat. If you want to build a bigger, better brain that functions better, you're going to have to eat fat. So the cholesterol in the egg, even though it's high, it does not raise cholesterol in the blood. So you don't have to worry about that. Another thing is they contain lutein and xanthan. Those are both antioxidants that really help with eyesight. Some kids are having to wear glasses at a very, very early age, and so by feeding them eggs, this is also going to increase the chances that it will improve their eyesight. So as you can see, eggs are incredibly nutritious. I'm just giving you some of the things. You can go on my blog. The link below will take you to my blog, which is, which is all about eggs and the importance of eating eggs. You can also go into my protected resource library that has all kinds of additional information to help you. There's a whole section on nutrition books that you may be interested in reading some of those that will help you as you're planning out menus for your children. So I want to leave you with just a few little fun um, play on words about eggs. First of all, to be a good egg means to be a nice person. To have scrambled eggs for brains means that you are scatterbrained. To be a hard-boiled egg means that you're extraordinarily stubborn. And to walk on eggshells means that you are dealing with sensitive people. I hope you enjoyed this. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you for joining me.